I'm just entering the drain via the curb outlet and working my way through toward the home on the left side. Okay, there was a section of pipe there that was slightly impacted, um, but nothing's penetrated, it hasn't worked through, so it appears of little consequence. Uh, we do go underwater here at this point, so we do have a bit of a sag. We'll just see where this leads. Okay. Okay, so we do have a little bit of a, um, a pipe sag here as well, um, but we'll continue to work through. So we've got a first junction here at 11.55 metres. Oh, yeah, it's just a bit of sediment on the line. Uh, that appears all okay. There appear to be large sections of uh, concrete as far as I can tell. I believe that's concrete or something filling the drain here at 12.81 metres. I'll just mark this location. Okay, so that's good. We'll continue to work through the main line. Okay, so third junction at 18.01 metres appears all okay. Okay, it looks like the, the um, drain actually runs vertically at this point, so it works up and around. I can't push any further. This must be at the left rear downpipe. I'll just double check the location. Okay, so I've tracked up as far as I can on this left side. As I say, we're running um, vertically now at that left side. We're up 24 metres. It's as far as I can track. So I will, um, so I will stop the camera there. Uh, as far as the line goes, as I say, this, the main combined line on this left side appears to be okay. Uh, apart from, there was a, an impact near the curb outlet, and it was sagging to six meters. However, they appear; those things appear of little consequence with the amount of gravity, um, uh, the amount of fall through to the section. It appears to be washing away and working all okay. <laughs> 